And we're back to learning GIMP and this time I'm going to show you how to create a fuzzy border. It's a different way to create a border but it can be applied to any photo once again. Just go to filters, decor and there it is. We'll go over every little detail. Let's first check the color right here. I'll keep it white. And the border size, self-explanatory, I'll keep it to 16. Let us just confirm it and create an example as a reference. So it's on a new file now. And you can see it up here. Let me zoom in. So this was the original and here we've got our fuzzy border. Let's get back to the original and we show the menu. We can blur the border. Let's check it and compare it to the unblurred results that we've had before. So all of the values are the same, but we've added this blur and you can see the difference. Let's get back to the original. Next is the granularity. Let's crank it up fully. And we've got rid of the blur again. And this creates these little stripes and dots. So even if you zoom out, you can see it. And here the granularity was very low. We can also add a shadow. Let's go back to around the 4 for the granularity and we can adjust the shadow weight below it. The shadow weight is basically like the opacity you could say. For this shadow we'll keep it at 100%. And I've got the box checked and here is our shadow. So here it is without, and here it is with a shadow. Finally, we've got this box, flatten image. To be honest, I've never had a photo where it made a difference. But let me show you this. I'll uncheck it, confirm it. All of the other values are the same. And if we compare these at the same zoom level, you can see that there is basically no difference. Obviously these, these stripes and dots are randomized differently, but the image looks the same. So this doesn't really have an impact. On work on copy, I've had it checked so that it is open in a new file, but you can add it in the same file by unchecking it. And this is how you can create a fuzzy border in GIMP. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.